Hello there everyone welcome back to Arts Authority today we will discuss about the topic why do arts make noise in this video we will discuss about this topic in detail so let's start the video arts make noise by rubbing their bodies against a solid surface or move one of their hind legs against the scraper on the gaster you can hear a scraping chirping or rustling sound when multiple insects make the sound of the same frequency simultaneously moreover it helps them communicate with their fellows and give them a call for help when building a nest mating or when they die furthermore carpenter ants can make the loudest noise that other species can hear in the form of vibrations ants make buzzing and chirping sounds when they move or rub their bodies against the substrate but humans do not detect these when only one insect makes a sound these insects can produce a loud sound when they scrape collectively which can be detected by the fellows at a distance of almost 20 to 25 feet the method of communication varies in ants and higher animals due to differences in their body size behavior and habitat higher animals have an internal communication mechanism as they produce voice through vocal cords in their throat in contrast insects have an external means of communication with their fellows or other members of different species because they do not have vocal cords to generate voice one of the most common communication methods is through chemical signaling or pheromone trailing that helps transfer messages to the following ant they can also make noises in different situations to deliver their messages through two different ways stridulation and drumming these insects rub their body parts like wings and legs with their abdomen or head to create a shrilling sound for conveying a message known as stridulation ants usually move their hind leg against the gesture particularly the scraper a specialized spike on their abdomens this stroking behavior helps create a scraping sound furthermore they can also produce noise by drumming which is a less sophisticated method of making sounds when the insect rubs its body against a hard surface accordingly drumming involves knocking their own body against a substrate to create a signal that helps grab the attention of their fellows ants make noises for various reasons like communicating and sending a signal to go foraging and building nest moreover it can be a call for help or mating to attract their partner ants produce sounds of varying frequencies in different situations to gain the attention of their nest mates they navigate surrounding separately and call others after finding a food source it can also be a trick to organize a colony because all the colony members will gather around the sound making insect as if they think it has found a food source moreover any workers make a loud noise by stridulating its gesture with its leg to call the nest mate for help to hold the heavy particles and take them back to the nest ants can get injured after predator attacks when they are navigating for food most of these insects lose their lives on the spot while a few can survive for a few hours the survivors make every possible effort to save their lives when they get badly injured and call their fellows to take them back to the nest from the death spot accordingly they begin to make noise or release chemicals to seek the attention of their fellows these insects will rub their legs against their body or stridulate to create a loud scraping sound ants make noise when they die or feel discomfort due to injured exoskeleton or broken legs and rub their bodies down the ground surface moreover they can survive 20 to 24 hours and die if they are not treated properly within a day workers can hear the noise of lucky ones and become life savers for them furthermore a small number of these injured insects can survive injuries while a significant proportion of ants will die if they cannot tolerate the deadly wounds Insects need the help of their nest mates to fight their enemies if there is a larger insect on the other side. Ants usually make scraping sounds when they accidentally come across a predator. Mature larvae cannot move around or cannot fight for their defense, so they create a loud noise to attract the attention of workers and soldiers to protect them. Moreover, they have a strong sense of detecting vibrations and slight movements on the ground to know their fellows are trapped by predators and shouting for help. Ants do not have ears like animals to hear sounds produced by scraping behavior of their nest fellows. However, they have different mechanism for hearing and understanding the signals. They can detect airborne and substrate borne vibrations produced by stridulations and drumming their bodies against a solid substrate. 
Furthermore, these insects have sensory receptors to detect the vibrations and process the frequency to modulate their actions and behavior accordingly. Thanks for watching the video.